And the situation was the same in Port Harcourt, where many schools were forced to close early. As early as 10 a.m. local time, news began to spread across the city that army officers were visiting schools and forcefully administering monkeypox vaccinations. That rumor spread quickly across the city and teachers struggled without success to explain to concerned parents who insisted on withdrawing their children. We just uh, got uh, information that people were running everywhere uh, in the streets, children everywhere, uh, telling us that uh, soldiers are coming to their schools to come and uh, give them uh, immunization, which uh, we don't know about. So uh, we had to run to the school to pick up our children too. These days we hear all kinds of things, you know. Um, we heard of uh, monkey paws. You know, some people are claiming that um, the monkey paws, uh, it was because of uh, an immunization that was given to the children that caused the, mon the monkey paws uh, in uh, Bayasa State. You know, so hearing this kind of thing, we get panicked. Coming from somewhere, I saw a student run up and down. I don't know, I asked, they said that uh, the military men that forced students to take injection, but we've not seen any military men. So I'm not here to pick my, my, my son, my son to the house now. So, so that run up and about the, the, par the parents, look at how people cry, they so, so cry, the women coming for the parents. Look at all, all the military school and other schools are running up and down. I saw students right from my way. I was asking them, what's going on? They said the teacher said they should go home, that the military is coming to inject them, monkey paws. That's what they are saying. So I mean, I don't, I've not seen this kind of thing in this country before. What's going on? Meanwhile, normalcy has returned to schools in neighboring Bielsa, where the state government has successfully nipped the vaccine rumor in the bud. TVC News Bicycle correspondent visited some schools in Yenagoa where pupils and students were engaged in academic activities after the monkeypox vaccine scare last week. Commissioner for Education Jonathan Obwebite spoke on measures taken by the state government to deal with the rumor. We had to call, call all our, t our principals and headmasters in our video schools to let them know that there's nothing like that. I also want to use this medium to commend His Excellency who asked us to act proactively. Immediately the rumor started. The rumor was a very wicked rumor that was sent out on Friday and it spread like wildfire. And as a government we decided to act proactively. And as I speak today, normalcy has been restored. All our public and private schools are functioning and all our children are back to school, both our boarding model schools and also the private schools. And parents now have confidence in government because we're able to allay their fears and restore confidence in the system. And that is why our schools are functioning. 